As a little kid, I was told to stay in during things like the Pledge of Allegiance and National Anthem, but I never really knew why. As I got older, I realized this was out of respect, and today there's an issue with Colin Kaepernick sitting during the National Anthem. So, have you ever stood up for something by sitting down? For grown-ups out there, we stay for the National Anthem no matter what, and Colin Kaepernick says otherwise, and today I will tell you why and give you my opinion. Colin Kaepernick sits down during the National Anthem in protest of unfair conditions for African Americans, Hispanics, Asians, and others. But people don't like this. Some support him 100%, some say he's rude, disrespectful, and some have even told him to leave the country. Although many people don't agree with what he's doing, I support it. Colin started, sit, started sitting during the National Anthem, but after a conversation with Nate, a former member of the Army, he takes a knee. His goal wasn't to disrespect, and it still isn't to disrespect the army or the country. It is to raise awareness and make America a better place for every race. So why would you not support this? Just in the past year, there have been many instances of unequal conditions for races. African Americans and other races have been treated differently, and people often just ignore it. I guess they don't care. But Colin Kaepernick said that he'd had enough. So, for example, uh, these ways that they aren't treated the same. Um, just a few days ago, in September 2018, Mama was sitting in his apartment when the police came in and was questioning him and eventually shot him and killed him. She claimed that she was in the wrong apartment and she thought it was hers. But... She was charged with manslaughter and released with a $300,000 bond. To me, I don't care who it is, what the color is. She went into a man's apartment, shot him, and killed him. I think she should be in jail. Um, there's other instances like the children being taken away from their family and their families being deported and many other things. Um... There are things arising from this, looking at a white woman's perspective. The black race has been abused, whether it's getting weird looks in the grocery store or being shot in their own home, there's no way to deny it. And I think that if you can't see what is happening, you are either blind or you are just oblivious. In the past, we've had people just like Colin that have stand, stood up for their race, like Martin Luther and Rosa Parks. Um, they were both civil rights activists and they were both very effective using their legally given rights to protest, which is exactly what Colin's doing. There's not a law saying you must stand for the national anthem at all times with your hand over your heart. It doesn't say that, that I know of. Um, I'm not saying that Colin is having it as easy or as hard as Martin Luther and Rosa Parks had because times definitely have changed but still people hate him for what he's doing even though he's doing the right thing um but I'm just saying that whenever you do take a stand like Colin is doing it will return like Martin Luther and Rosa Parks they got what they wanted for the most part and what they did was very effective so, in review, Colin kneels for every man or woman who is treated unfairly by the system and is trying to raise awareness for these problems. For growing up taught that we stand up for the national anthem no matter what, but Colin Kaepernick says otherwise, and today I told you why, and I gave you my opinion. So, have you ever stood up for something by sitting down?